said hi to them, you made their day. You know, their mother hasn't called them, their father hasn't called them, their cousins hasn't called them. They just, they was just in the men's home like me. They was, you know what I'm saying? It, it's real going on in the world to where when you use certain words, you have to understand that words are worse than a gun. Like how I say it all the time, like that whole shit with the with the word gay and then or or you know this and that. It's just some some shit just bothers me. You know how many people, how many human beings have died just because of one fucking word? It makes no fucking sense. Yeah. So why play with certain words? We 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 and man, anything can survive with respect. Right. You can put anybody in a room full of killers if they got respect, they're gonna walk out that motherfucker better than the next man that didn't have respect. Facts. So you put you put strength on words because again there was a meme I seen where they said right in the '60s where gay was meant happy and slowly in the '60s going into the '70s where that word started changing to the homosexual word of it and it's like people still use the word in a happy sense but then you got you got blasted for even using the word because now it's changing the meaning so do people put too many too much emphasis on meanings of words you can't do things without knowing that royalty comes first inside of one soul. There you go. And then everyone is royal in their own way. So you see somebody, you say, what up, king? Hey, what's up, queen? You know, it's certain people that you approach that you have to be the person that that light that they see. And and, and I know it's dark out here, but at the, at the end of the day, if you are the tool that God is using to, to make that person, some people don't even know that. You can say hi to somebody and fucking brighten their whole shit up. Nobody talked to them all day long, but you said hi to them. Thanks. You fucking said hi to them. You made their day. You know, their mother hasn't called them. Their father hasn't called them. Their cousins hasn't called them. They just, they was just in the men's home like me. They was, you know what I'm saying? It, it's real shit going on in the world to where when you use certain words, you have to understand that words are worse than a gun. Words are worse than a gun. If you're going to say some shit, you're going to mean that shit. Like I keep saying, it's G A Y God Allah Yahweh. Right. Break these syllables down to the first thing that you can think of that's positive. You know, uh, that spells happy to me. Those three things: God, Allah, Yahweh. These these things, these words that that, that create our entity that we have that created us. Wow. That's what makes me happy. So that's what I can think of when I see when I say when, when it was G A Y God Allah Yahweh, and then you break that shit down into the other way. Now, if a person like I always say, if it's gonna be if you nigga, if you if you homosexual, my nigga, that don't mean you're not my brother. There you go. That's a chain. That don't mean you're not my sister. That don't mean you it, it just just wear that shit and wear it proudly, and don't be trying to force nobody into what you're thinking because you got hurt or because you made a decision to go play in the lake, motherfucker, and drowned, came back up. And now it ain't the same no more. You want somebody else to feel that shit. No, 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 motherfucker. No, don't play. It's not, it's, it, it's, this is, this is why I asked him to bring, the, it, it is, it's not a game. This is, this is really going on right now. This is really going on right now. Like you, they, they, they act like it's a, like it's like a, a like it's a real game. Like, the Bible is actually happening now. And when you take us back, that means that you're taking us back literally. It's rubbish. You know what I'm saying? Certain words do not need to be acknowledged and certain things don't need to be done based off of people's experiences and bumping their head in the past situations. So if we're going to keep on playing our games and keep on being young and keep on being stupid, then no, we can't have it in living color. No, we can't have an Orlando Brown show. No, we can't do this. No, we can't do that. Because so many people are acting like they are so fucking perfect and acting like they're so fucking just, oh, I'm a, I, 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 I. no, bitch, you're not Nicki Minaj. And I love Nicki Minaj, but yeah, yeah, yeah. I love the, I love the real Nicki Minaj. And you're not going to be her. You're never going to be her. You're never going to see her, bitch. Cause she's going to pull up on you and she's going to have some shit to say. And that's the thing, like, you know what I'm saying? It, same with Janae Aiko. Same with, uh, it's a lot of our female artists that I feel like don't get the record. Even Khalees, I feel like. Not Khalees. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. I, it's, it's just, it, it, it's so many things that need to be addressed. But if we just start addressing ourselves first, then we can start addressing things that go on in the world because we'll be able to mask ourselves into what we're actually looking at. 
okay, I'm, dis I'm, I'm detached from what the fuck I was right here. Okay, I was stuck over there, so now I can actually look at something. A lot of people don't even need to be fucking looking at phones right now, bro. Oh, oh man. A lot of people don't even have to don't even have the right. They don't even have to need to have the right to pens, yeah. pens, paper. Yeah. Some people don't need to have the right to a lot of shit. But they have it. No, they think they have it. Mm. That's the problem. It's here today and gone. Hey, tomorrow, let's go. Shout out to Real Street Stars, nigga. Moolah. Hey.